welcome. Thank you for coming. We're so excited to see all of your faces. Um, I have to tell you, it's been a long time before we can start playing handbells again, thanks to the pandemic. And uh, we played in small groups and everybody kept missing it. And so we finally decided in February we could get back to do this. So we masked up and practiced every week until everybody got comfortable or shots or whatever they needed to do. So we're so glad that we're able to do this. And our music today, this is why we wanted to do a concert. So it gives us the opportunity to play other songs other than our sacred music. So we're gonna give you a mixture today. And as we play the different songs, I'm gonna to explain to you some of the different techniques that we're using and uh, a little history about the bells and the instruments that we are playing. <clears throat> Excuse me. So we're gonna start off with the Lord's Prayer. We played that this morning at the 11 o'clock service, but felt like it was a good song to start. Peace, God of amazing grace, we're going to use choir chimes as well as bells. And this looks like a tuning fork. Mm, kind of sounds like Avon's call. <laughs> and we'll also be using mallets. Um, you can beat these bells, you can swing them. Uh, you can hit them on the table. There's a lot of different techniques to bells. You need them, don't you? Sorry. Uh, so, um, 
and we'll be using several different techniques today and I'll tell you what they are as we get to those songs but um, I'm, I'm trying to do a little dance here so they can get all the stuff together <laughs> but um, this is one of our favorite pieces God of Amazing Grace decided that a lot of these composers for uh, pop music don't think about handbells when they write them. <laughs> and so we decided this next piece is Yesterday by the Beatles, and we considered writing them a letter. <laughs> and if they ever decide to write something else, please think about handbells when you're doing this, because there's a lot of changes from sharp to natural and back, and you're having to really work at it. Um, 
these bells are set up. We have right now, we're only playing three and a half octaves, but um, we have four. But they're set up like a piano keyboard, so you have white handles, black handles are the sharps and flats. So it's technically just like a piano keyboard would be. But, you know, Carol Denson here is not a fan of yesterday. <laughs> We've had to work on this off and on for the last year or so, uh, and we worked in sections on it, and uh, I wouldn't call it perfection. I mean, we're never going to be perfected. Um, for those of you that don't know, there are handbell choirs, uh, the Raleigh Ringers are nationally, well, they're internationally known, and they travel around the world playing handbells. And the choir and some of you in the audience were, we were, uh, excited and we got to go see the Raleigh Ringers when they were in the DFW area and it's they have to try out and they have to try out every year and they practice three four two or three hours a day and then they hit the road and they have to take their own personal time off but uh, it, it was quite a show but um, we're just a little volunteer choir here at the church and not everyone, well, I think everyone right now might read music, but I've had players that don't. So um, I just always say when I recruit, if you can count to four, you can probably play animals. <laughs> but, um, but sometimes we have to go to six. So that's a little hard. But this next piece is Phantom of the Opera, one of my favorites.
I'm going to give them a, a rest off their feet. But this, uh, first, let me tell you a little history about handbells. If you've heard us play before, I've probably mentioned this. But for those who don't know, uh, English handbells used to be the only handbells there were, and they played them in England. And each, each little community or town, they had their own handbell choirs. And the um, residents would buy their own bells, so I might be B or C, and somebody else would buy the rest of the bells, and they'd come together as a group and play as a choir for the community. Um, English handbells are made by Whitechapel, and uh, they're very, very expensive. I, Luann's had the pleasure of playing some, but uh, we have bought American handbells, and there's two sets that are made in America, and these are one, and it's Malmark is our manufacturer. And an, uh, an American handbell only rings in one direction. So this is gonna ring, but if I turn it around, it'll kinda sorta make a noise, but see, it doesn't. So uh, the clappers, and the strike points are different for English and American handbells. Um, also, I'm going to tell you in this piece. So sometimes I will tell you uh, if they really don't want to be heard. And I have timid ringers; they'll turn their bell around. <laughs> in this piece, we're going to be using uh, what's called singing bells. And we just use a stick. And you're going to hear it, and you go around the rim of the bell. These bells are pretty substantial, but you can't. They can crack. They are bronze. You can crack them. We've had to replace a few over the years. I started this bell choir in 2000. So our bells are 21 years old. Um, so we, can, we beat them with mallets. We ring them with sticks. Uh, we swing them. We just about do anything. You, uh, we'll we'll hit them on the table here pretty soon for you. So uh, there's all kinds of percussive sounds you can make with a bell. But now we're going to play uh, this sacred silence we played uh, during Lenten season. Obviously not this last year, but year before. Not it's been two years, I guess. But we just love the piece, and it's kind of an eerie piece, and so we wanted to share it with you today. Sacred Silence.
before the next piece, I'll ask if anybody has a question that maybe I haven't answered. Did if you, you talk about joining? Do what? Well, for those, uh, we're called the Joy Ringers because it was a lady in this church, uh, Joy Hinton, and she was a member of the choir here, and she thought handbells were beautiful, and she always wanted some for our church. And when she passed away, they set up a fund, and there was money put into the handbell fund. And when Wally and I came to this church, I made the mistake of saying, what's this money for? And, and they said, well, for handbells, but nobody knows anything about them. And I said, well, I played them when I was in elementary school. <laughs> and they said, you're qualified. <laughs> so that's, we became the Joy Ringers in her honor. Um, and we have four octaves of bells, four octaves of chimes, and beautiful ringers. I've had different people over the years. Uh, I probably have some in the audience who has played for me before. Um, but uh, we just have a good time. It's good fellowship. And we're just, hopefully, we are blessing you with music. This next piece is an uh, original piece for handbells, Raps DNF Mama. This next piece is kind of similar, uh, symphonic fanfare, uh, but it's a little more majestic. Um, kind of, I wanted to say one of our easier pieces, but I shouldn't say that because we'll probably screw it up. <laughs>
before we play our last piece, I want to tell you we are anticipating that we will be playing a Christmas concert uh, on a Sunday afternoon in December. And I saw that my flautist was here. I hadn't told her yet, but we'd love for you to play with us. Uh, we're going to possibly be doing a uh, hallelujah chorus with the organ, uh, a piece with a I wander as a wander with a flute. Um, so, and we have a synthesizer, so it's, it's going to be a lot of different instruments playing with the bells. Um, so we want to invite all of you back, and I'll keep you informed of when that date might be. Uh, we'll be playing in the church services, uh, one, mm, probably in the fall, we'll do an October play and probably do some spirituals. But, um, we appreciate all of you coming. Uh, it, you have just blessed us for being here, and I hope you've enjoyed it. The last number that we always do <clears throat> is Because He Lives. <clears throat> 